Peek at you ad agency. No, we are peek at you ad agency. Not peek at you ad agency. Nothing to do with Pokemon. No, we don't film porn either. But we aren't trying to get a peek at you. The ads help the customer get a peek at you, your business. Huh? Yes, we're serious. Tuesday at 3 p.m., let me check my schedule. Yeah, uh, that, that, that'll work. Tuesday at 3 p.m. will work. I'll pin you in for then. They were an ad agency with lots of potential. Potential to do things wrong. They couldn't get things to go their way. Some people hit rock bottom. These guys jackhammer past it. Meet Charles. So what happened with the cereal company? What was the final outcome with that? What do you mean, what happened? They were trying to market a box of dicks to little kids. It was just finger-shaped cereal. Yeah. Fingers that look like kids are about to dive in a big fat sugary bowl of dick. On top of that, the size of the cereal wasn't even consistent. And that's why as a Texas State student, I need all the nutrition I can get. That's why I have finger food cereal. It gives me all the nutrition I need so I can do well in class. What the fuck? <laughs> Well, there has to be at least one thing that we got paid really well for. Meet Jesse. There was that big name beer company that the taste test ad with us. Yeah, only because they paid us up front. Handsomely, I might add. One of these is a national name brand beer. The other one is not. Take a taste of cup A and cup B and tell us which one you think to find to be the better tasting one. Here is cup A, sir. <coughs> So let's get a taste of cup B here, sir. There you go, there is cup B for you. <coughs> now, which one do you think was, was the name brand beer? Uh, you know, I don't really know. They kind of both tasted the same. Let me try this one again. One of them was actually urine. <coughs> Which one was urine, bro? Uh, you honestly can't tell the difference? Which one was urine? Oh, Which shit! One? Yeah, that wasn't so good for our rep. And that beer really does taste like piss. I don't want to get into how you know what the taste of piss is. And what was with the production of some of these ads? I think we might need to find some better contractors. Well, that stuff we got from Slyly was pretty cool. I mean, take a look. Are you talking about this off-the-wall dentist commercial that looks like Lorena Boppet is about to yank your teeth out? Quality was good. Message was hell. Literally. All I know is one thing, and that's that my dad isn't going to keep floating us money to keep this place alive. We need to start bringing in some money, man. Their work conversations are not exactly PC. You no. Know, Reminds me of something my grandmother used to say. Oh yeah, what's that? Uh, she said, uh, what good's a barking dog with no intruders? Huh? What the hell is that supposed to mean? I don't know, that's so why I'm asking you. She was senile, pissed to bed daily. <laughs> if the scams got any better, they might actually become actual businessmen. <laughs> Stop playing with the damn dinkus and bring me the dinkus for the live copy, alright? From the guys that didn't bring you Mad Men. Oh yeah? Well my grandma damn near died after she saw that cereal commercial. Threw up, started choking on it. Put her in a coma. Come a couple of Mad Men. Oh yeah? Well my dad had a heart attack after he saw that dentist commercial. Is there ever a time your family doesn't get a serious medical defect from watching television? Fuck you, man. You too!
Mad Men, boldly going nowhere.